We will learn how to make an image typography in Photoshop, so let's get started. To create a typography image effect, go to File, New. Let's name it Typography with Image. Width will be 4000, height will be 2000 pixel. All other things are looking perfect, click OK. First add the adjustment layer of solid color. We will choose a blue background for this. We don't want the background layer, so delete it. Double click on layer to rename it as background. Take the type tool or press T, type G. I'm using Monstrate font. You can download this font for free. The link is in the description. Place G in center. Now press Ctrl or Command R to show the ruler and drag a guide on the mid. Drag another guide on top of the G. Just give it some space. Now while holding Alt, drag the G to the right. Simultaneously press Shift to move the G in straight line. Rename it Y with the text tool. Now again take the copy and repeat the process. Type M. While holding Ctrl, select all layers and position it in center. We will use these three images and incorporate them inside each letter. While holding Alt Shift, scale them down. Move Gym 1 layer to the left and Gym 3 layer to the right. And Gym 2 layer in the mid. We need to flip the Gym 1 layer. So select it, press Ctrl or Command T, right click, flip horizontal. Scale it more and position it on the letter. Similarly adjust the Gym 2 layer as well. Now we will first work on G letter. While holding Ctrl or Command, click on G layer, it will make a selection of G. Now press T for default colors, black and white. Select Gym 1 layer and add a layer mask on it. Take the brush tool, decrease the size of it, change foreground color to white. Now paint white color inside the mask to show the image. Same thing we will do for other letters as well. Just remember white will be used to show the image and black color will be used to hide the image. And you should only paint inside the mask. Select all image layers, press Ctrl or Command G to make a group name it as images. Make a group of text as well. Let's add some depth. Right click open the blending option for text. Trick drop shadow. Distance will be 100. Angle 90. Size will also be 100. Just decrease the opacity to 70%. Click OK. Now the shadow is applied in all letters because all are in a single group. Add another layer on top. Take the brush tool. Choose the color white. Increase the brush size and decrease the hardness. Now let me show you a trick. Click one time on top left. Now while holding shift, click on top right. It will make a straight flow. Set its blending option to overlay. Opacity will be 80%. Rename it shine. Add another adjustment layer of solid color. Make it blue. Set the blending option to soft light. Set its opacity to 30%. We actually add a blue tint on the image. Rename it as blue tint. Add adjustment layer of levels to add more contrast. Slide the mid tones to the right and whites to the left. Make a group and rename it as effects. If you learn something new, hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon so you don't miss the learning updates. My name is Shubham. Thank you so much for watching Graphic Aina. Let's meet on another great tutorial for the timing. Goodbye.